Western Carolina trying to get a rare road win in Chattanooga. Cats coming off two straight home wins in Southern Conference play and trying to do something they haven't done all year, and that's win a road game in a place they never seem to win. Only three wins all time in Chattanooga. And it was another tough night last night as they were cheering early and often for the mocks. They were on the attack. Eric Robertson, nice pump fake, moved down the pace line good. Torian Brumman had a pretty big night for the Catamounts. He keeps him in early, shooting a mid-range jumper about 15 feet. He had 15 points. Trey McLean answers, nifty ball skills of his own, watched behind the back in traffic, and the finish. Catamounts kept trying to chip away in the first half. The big man again, this time down low, uses that body. But the Cats shoot only 38%, mocks 49%. Western out rebounded by 10. Chattanooga whips the Catamounts 77-58. Cats at Samford on Saturday. UNC Asheville trying to stay in first in the Big South. Uh, they lost at Radford in overtime, 91-86. Big night for Will Weeks. He had 23 points and 10 rebounds, but co-leader High Point lost, and so now there's a three-way tie with Asheville, High Point, and Gardner-Webb. One of the best prep soccer players the Mountains has produced in recent years, coming back home. Former Reynolds star midfielder forward Megan McAllister transferring from Charlotte to Western Carolina. Remember, she led Reynolds to a state title last season and was an All-Stater. McAllister scored five goals in her freshman year at Charlotte and made the All-Freshman team for Conference USA. She'll be eligible this year to play for the Catamounts. McAllister wanted to be closer to home, and I know Western welcomes this great talent. Good luck to her. Asheville's American Legion baseball team, post-70, has a new coach, Shane Galloway, an assistant with Robertson the last four years, and a Rosman alum takes over from uh, Court Radford, who stepped down as post-70 coach and Irwin coach. Galloway played basketball and baseball at Brevard College. Congrats. And congrats to former McDowell Titan and East Carolina alum and NFL alum, Dwayne Ledford. He's headed to NC State to coach the Pack's offensive line and be its run game coordinator. Ledford just finished his fourth year at Appalachian State as offensive line coach.